what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel we have this fun question that says find the value of a given that 6 to power a minus 2 to power a is equal to 32. well our first step will be for us to simplify this 6. we know that 6 is same as 3 times 2 and this is raised to power a minus we have 2 to power a equal to 32. now let's apply the law of indices by distributing this a to 3 and 2. so this is 3 to power a times 2 to power a minus 2 to power a equal to 32. now notice that 2 to power a is common so we can factor out 2 to power a then open bracket now we have this this term divided by 2 to power a we have 3 to power a remaining minus now 2 to power a divided by 2 to power a we have 1 and this is equal to 32. now notice that we have two factors on the left which are 2 to power a and 3 to power a minus 1 which multiplies to give 32. That means we're going to be writing out the factors of 32. Factors of 32 are 1 times 32. We have 2 times 16. And we also have 4 times 8. So these factors also multiplies to give 32. But then again, notice something. 2 to power a is always even. And 3 to power a is odd. But when we subtract 1, it will always be even. So we have this factor as well to be even. So two even factors multiplies to give 32. So we're only interested in even factors of 32 that multiplies. Now, 1 times 32, 1 is not an even factor. So we're going to be rejecting this. We're not going to be using this. This is even times another even factor to give 32. This is even and this is even. So we're going to call this case 1 and we'll call this case 2. Now let's solve this case by case. So for the first case, we have case 1. For case 1, we have 2 to power a times 3 to power a minus 1 equal to. Now write out the factors. We have 2 times 16. Now notice that 2 to power a is always smaller than 3 to power a minus 1. So that means we compare, use the smaller factor, which is 2 to power a, and equate it to the smaller factor of 32, which is 2. Then take the bigger factor, 3 to power a minus 1, and equate it to the bigger factor of 32, which is 16. Good. Now 2 is same as 2 to power 1 and I notice that the bases are the same so since the bases are the same we equate the powers so a is equal to 1 now let's try this in our second equation here so if a is 1 we have 3 to power 1 minus 1 equal to 16 so 3 to power 1 is 3 minus 1 that would be 2 and we know that 2 is not equal to 16. So we're going to be rejecting this case. It is not true. Now let's move on to case 2. So for case 2, we have 2 to power a times 3 to power a minus 1 to be equal to. The factors are 4 times 8. Now let's compare. We have the smaller factor, which is 2 to power a equate that to the smaller factor of 32 that is 4 and then take the bigger factor 3 to power a minus 1 and equate that to the bigger factor of 32 which is 8. now let's focus on this this is 2 to power a equal to now 4 is same as 2 to power 2. now see that the bases are the same 2 and 2 so we can equate their powers so we have a to be equal to 2. So if a is 2, 
Let's load that in here. This is 3 to power a, a is 2, minus 1, equal to 8. 3 squared is 9, minus 1, equal to 8. So 9 minus 1 is 8, which is equal to the right hand side, 8. That means a equal to 2 is a solution. Well, feel free to share your ideas in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video and have learned something from this video, Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, turn on the notification bell so you don't miss my upcoming videos. And like I always say, until next time, take care.